Say hello, this is my first video. Say this is my puppy Shiloh, her tweet girl. Say hello with your glowing eyes. And to let everybody know this little kiosk at the post office. You can scan your own packages now. Other services. Scan prepaid. Uh, uh, you scan it down here. Hit what you're going to and voila. Alright, howdy y'all. I'm Jerry Wayne. I'm going to try to start me a YouTube channel just like everybody else. Mine, I'm going to try to base it on my eBay sales and fitness and when i say fitness i'm not talking about i'm going to teach you anything it's more of an accountability for myself but that'll come later right now oh first of all the introduction the little puppy you saw at the beginning that was my baby girl shiloh she will be involved in every video that i do love that little girl just like she's my daughter so, let's get started on what I want to do first, is I had a return. Now, I don't think the person that returned it was honest, but we'll see. Also, tell you what, while I'm at it, let me show you around my little place. I live in an apartment. And as you know, apartments really ain't that big. Well, this one here has garages, as you can see, garage door. So I rent out a garage for a hundred dollars a month, and I store my eBay inventory in here. I sell anything from clothing to whatever. Um, I also have my music collection that I am trying to get rid of on eBay it's not listed yet part of my death pile and I know a lot of people say don't sell videos and don't sell this well when you've had it for years and you really ain't invested in it anymore what are you gonna do you're gonna make money might not make as much as you did when you actually bought it but that was 10, 12, 20 years ago. I mean, most of my music is 80s and 90s. Some 70 records, but we'll see how that goes later. But anyway, like I said, what I want to do is do this opening of this box here. Got a box, return. See, first class return. Which means I paid for it because he said it was broken. And it's a classic Mickey Mouse watch. But what's ironic to me about it being broken and don't work is that right before I shipped it out, I took it to a retrable ju ret I can't speak. You'll understand that later. A jeweler here in town and had a brand new battery put in it and it was working fine when I left left it in the box now the box is in great shape same box I shipped it in so different bubble wrap that's not the same bubble wrap I sent it in but hey you know, at least they bubble wrapped it you know I've had a lot of people return stuff saying it didn't work and come to find out it did you know, eBay needs to work on two things one not everybody that sends something back is right I guess it goes back to the customers right thing no the customer not is not always right and I'm sorry to see I'm a realistic I'm not gonna sit there and tip blow smoke up your butt and tell you that you know, everything's all great and uh, 
rosy on the other side because it's not. So, you know, people are liars. They will do whatever it takes. And since eBay automatically makes them, makes you accept a return and pay for the label when they say item not as described, everybody's going to do that. I'm trying to get this at an angle where it can be seen as I open it. Because that's the whole purpose. I open up everything and make a video even before I did YouTube because I just don't trust people returning the proper item, do a switch on you, or, you know, people are not honest these days. Let's just face it. You know, people are crooked. People will lie. I'll try to be as honest as I can with you. You know, I really didn't expect this video to be that long. But trying to open this. Well, I'll give him credit. He wrapped it real good. All right. So let's see. It's still ticking. Still has a back on it. Let's see. It is 10.36. And it says 11.36. I'm not sure... Where did I send it to? I sent it to Pennsylvania. So, yep, an hour ahead. So, it's still keeping time. Just want to show everybody. So, this was a buyer's remorse. This is what's wrong with you, eBay. You, you make me pay for the return shipping. On an item that is perfectly good. There is nothing wrong with this item. I, I, I don't know what to say. Because eBay is not going to correct it. They're not going to correct anything that is good for the buyer. We've had that proven time and time again. It's like buy it now. I mean not buy it now. But um, accept an offer. How many of you out there have always had at least one or two people, I say always, how many people out there, sellers, have had a seller send you an offer, you either accept it or counter offer it, and then they don't pay for it? Why? They're the ones that made the offer. You know, even if you send out an offer to a buyer and he chooses to buy that item at the discount you sent it for, whether it be 5, 20, 50%, whatever. Why do you not pay for it? If you don't intend to buy it, why are you saying you will buy it? Technically, when you say you buy it, you're entering a binding contract with that seller. Therefore, you're Technically, if someone wanted to, they could start a lawsuit. I know it's stupid, but maybe somebody that knows the law and can do it themselves and just for the fun of it wants to enter a lawsuit because you are entering a binding contract agreeing that you will purchase that product from that person for that amount. And when you don't, you screw everything up. But anyway, enough about that. The watch is the same. I mean, I can tell because of the, I don't know if you can see that, it's a sample version. Sold it for $80 plus shipping, I think. I don't know. But I'll be refunding his money. Um, the shipping he will not get back. I don't give anybody back their shipping because I'm not getting back your shipping. Maybe I have to cost a business give you your money back and send you a label but i don't have to give you your shipping feedback because that's gone that's not coming back to my pocket that is not going to your pocket so we'll see what we can do more later about everything okay y'all i know this video might be a little corny and stuff but you know this is my first one so give me a break wife's in there laughing about something anyway 
this is my video this is what I'm putting out for my first video you like it you love it and that's up to you Shala hey baby you gonna say goodbye to everybody say bye bye you sweet thing